inspiration means uh, background of mine. But I give, want to give uh, for students from Lapland, from the Arctic area. Hello, my name is Lauri Snellman. Um, I'm a teacher in the University of Lapland. I'm teaching industrial design uh, in our workshop now was, you know, the day in the, in the forest and, and you had, you know, the one, one big lock and the, to, um, to make um, the uh, fire like, like Lamberjack have done hundred thousand years. So, hi, my name is uh, Dimitri Peters. Uh, I'm from Belgium um, and I'm studying product design. For me, like, Arctic, Arctic inspiration is now being a real um, inspiration, you know, to say so far. We, we really did a lot of uh, nice things. It's one of the main reasons I came here to really get in touch with nature, like we're doing this week. I have the feeling of how these Finnish people are living here. Uh, that's really nice for me. Yeah, so, I mean, it's great. My name is Polina and I'm a student from Germany. At home I'm studying uh, product design, especially uh, work with ceramics and porcelain. I think this trip is a very good um, experience to see how you can work with nature. I just want to know how people live in this environment because it's quite hard or more harder than than in, in the uh, South Europe, to know some important things about uh, to survive. Maybe when you're alone in the forest and you have to know how to make fire, otherwise you would die or uh, get lost. The, the way to take food from the nature. For example, uh, ice fishing. Sami people, for example, and people in Lapland, they, they do fish from the river or the lakes. I'm Karel, um, I'm studying in Belgium, product design. Hi, my name is Kliva, I'm from Canada and I study industrial design here at the University of Lapland. I really like this place because uh, it's quite overwhelming and I think everybody is quite overwhelmed by the beauty and the quietness of this place, the, the snow is really pure and it feels quite nice to just step into it as the first person who actually does it because you can see your traces when you're walking back. Uh, I find it's really nice walking around here because we're really in the woods so there's no other sounds than maybe a little bit of wind or the sounds of our snowshoes. So it's really relaxing and also with the, um, the grey skies that we were having in the past two months, well, it's really nice to have sunlight. And it's quite, no, it's quite mind-opening, in my opinion. Um, and uh, like Quiva said, like the sun is really amazing after two dark months. But I hope that in the couple like of days that are still Coming, that we can also do like a lot of active things like skiing and snowmobiling and I'm looking re I'm really looking forward to that as well because uh, I think it will be a totally different experience than this and uh, I hope it will be as enjoyable as this one as well hi everyone I'm Gianluca Bartolini uh, I come from Italy, Milan. Uh, I study at Politecnico di Milan and I love the speed, I love engine, I love cars, are my passion. I like a lot motorbike, so 
I'm looking forward to see how is the snowmobile. I hope that uh, I'm quite sure that will be an amazing experience and one of the yeah one of the so many good experience that we are having here in Arctic Inspiration. Uh, people in Arctic area have already had different kind of vehicles to, to move and to change the place. Before was was huskies, then in the beginning of 60, the end of 50, the came scooter. Uh, my name's Oliver Chiswell and I'm from Australia and I'm studying industrial design at the University of Canberra and I'm studying that here as well. Ulas, Ulas was really good. Yeah, we had a good time. We went with our, it was I and two other guys, two guys from Belgium, we went to Ulas Ski Resort and it was a lot of fun. The two other guys went backcountry and off the trails and then I went to the main slopes and down the parks and things and yeah it was it was an awesome time. About the sauna. Sauna here um, I think Laurie found a really good sauna and it's been nice just having big saunas with everybody here it's definitely a very Finnish way to do things. I've never seen this anywhere else. I'm Julia from Austria and I study industrial design. So we just built up the tent in there. It was very interesting. First we didn't know what to do. <laughs> but then we kind of figured out and had this kind of group. And, um, it felt really like in a group you accomplish something and in the end you see the result and it feels very nice. But the important is to take care of the nature uh, and it's stupid to take from nature more than the nature can give back by himself. If you take too much then it's going, the value is going down in some days. Uh, Hi, my name is Hanne and I come from Belgium. I study product design in Belgium and here I do industrial design, it's kind of the same. It's nice to see how people from different countries can all live together without having any problems actually. Especially here in a cabin in the woods. Um, it's been an amazing trip and I think everybody should do this. And maybe like at the beginning of your student exchange so you get to know the people already. Um, and every class should do it, not only industrial design. Yeah, I think we make friends for life. Yeah.